Okay, so today we're going to look at a pattern. I did um, I did readings at uh, the shop today at the I in Minneapolis, so I was able to do readings for a bunch of people. And back in the day when I was doing readings at the shop all the time, there would be like weeks where the same card would show up for everybody, right? So today, and, and when I'm not doing readings for masses of people, I don't really get to see it. But today, I got to see it. And the card of the day was the Five of Pentacles. So this shit is going through everybody. And the Five of Pentacles is basically about feeling very exiled and alone and judged, right? So it makes sense in today's world that everyone is dealing with this and even today i mean as i was uh, about to go to this coffee shop um, i'm like am i actually going to get service here because uh, there's like this vaccine mandate that's happening in minneapolis and it's a place that i have gone to for like 10 years and have been a regular and i'm like oh my god i was definitely feeling this the fucking eyeball looking at me, and I'm like, oh my god, can I even come here? It was it was quite a thing. So, what we're going to do is just look and see what we can do to deal with this. What can we do to deal with this five? Let's move this light so it's not shining on that. Actually, that didn't help at all. Whatever. Okay. So how do we deal with the Five of Pentacles? Is there even anything we can do? We're going to put it over here. Well, maybe we'll try to surround it. So we got these. Okay. <laughs> so... One thing, both of these cards are major arcana cards, so these are big energies. But, so the card that shows up in place, so what happens here? This this person is like homeless and they have nothing, you know? And they're like wandering around the streets alone and they have no money and no clothes, and like no place to live. So here's this church and they could stay in this church if they really wanted to, but it comes with this judgment and all of this bullshit. So they're like, fuck it. I'm going to deal with this. I'm going to do it myself, right? So what lines up with the church and the judgment is the wheel of fortune. And what can we do about that? The answer is pretty much nothing. The Wheel of Fortune is like destiny and karma, and this is like greater universe energies that we truly can't do anything about. Now, on the other side, this is the street that she's walking, right? We get the Hermit. So, the Hermit, this card also showed up in almost all of the readings today. So, the Hermit is about what you know within yourself. I always describe the hermit as the book that you write, not the book that you read. Because the hermit doesn't... It, it's not about what anyone else tells you. It's not about what anyone else thinks they know. The hermit is about what you know within yourself. Um, what I usually tell people when the hermit shows up, it's like you have to remember who you are and what's inside of you. Generally, people are filled with gold, and the hermit is the process with which we separate from what all the other fuckers are saying long enough that we remember who we are and what we're here to do. We remember that we are filled with gold. And this is like a little process of separation from other people's crap, long enough that we can spend some time with our personal knowledge, our personal perspective. And when we spend enough time with that, then we can bring it out to the rest of the world. But what can you do about feeling exiled and judged? I mean, as far as the judgment and shit, really nothing. But um, what you can do as you kind of deal with that situation is remember who you are. 
and remember that you are filled with gold. So, like, other people are saying a bunch of stupid shit, and the hermit says, just remember what you know. Remember who you are. So, this energy is a huge wave. It's going through a bunch of people. It was in every reading except for one today, and it really did come out with with the hermit in um, almost all of those cases. But hopefully this is helpful, and if you do have any requests for um, topics that I can do readings on, feel free to leave them in the comments. I am also available for personal readings, and you could hit me up in the comments and we can figure it out from there. Um, also, my link tree is on like all of the things that you would watch this on, but uh, peace.